Now to a News 15 update on breaking news. We brought you last night here live at 5. A train and fire derailment in Eunice briefly triggering flashbacks for some for a major derailment in their community some 24 years ago. Luckily, yesterday's rail mishap paled in comparison. Mm -hmm. News 15's Drake Car Francois unravels what happened and the latest has the latest on the investigation there in Eunice tonight. 24 hours after two train cars caught fire and derailed, causing a shelter in place in the town of Eunice, officials say the rail traffic is now back open. While the trains are moving again, it comes after some tense moments from people living in the area. These are two charred train cars off the tracks near North St. Mary Road. The flames from the burning taker cars jumped to a nearby railroad bridge and smoke from the mishap was seen for miles. At this point, it's still unknown what triggered the fire. The train was parked. Initially, the train had parked for approximately 30 minutes. They were waiting for another train to come through to pass them. They were crossing, and I'm not exactly sure what caused it. It's under investigation at this time, but something started to fire. Officials say there was acid inside of the burning train cars, which resulted in a shelter-in-place order for those living in the area. Luckily, no one was hurt. We went to shelter in place immediately after once the chief called and said that the train was moved. So it, it really, everything worked out as good as it could be today because of all the people involved and all the extra help that showed up. Reporting for News 15, I'm Drake Hart Francois.